Have you ever wondered what it's like being a Nashville touring musician? Well, stay tuned for this video. Some of you might not know this, but when I'm not doing videos, my normal job is as a professional touring musician. I play with a modern country married duo. A duo called Thompson Square. Are you gonna kiss me or not? This life would kill me if I didn't have you. So I thought it'd be cool to show you guys what it's like on the road. So I hope you enjoy this video. All right, so it's almost midnight. I'm getting ready to go to bus call. Bus call is where all the musicians and crew meet at a central location and hop on the bus. So we usually leave Nashville around midnight and drive overnight to our destination. Uh, on this run, our first show is in North Dakota, which is kind of far from Nashville, so we're actually driving to Madison, Wisconsin first, spending the day there so our driver can rest and driving overnight again and uh, ending up in North Dakota. I will be heading to the bus right now. Hopefully it'll be on time. So we made it to Madison, Wisconsin. Uh, it was about a 12 hour drive. Uh, I slept maybe five or six hours solid. And then I got up, cause I usually get up around seven or eight in the morning anyway. So normally on a day off, I would work out, have a nice meal, go to a mall, see a movie or something. But uh, I actually have a lot of video editing to do for some gear demo videos that I shot last week. So I will be editing video most of the day here in the hotel room. We're only gonna be here for the day because we're leaving again at midnight. This bed will be unused. So I'm gonna leave it like that. I'm not even gonna like lay down and chill out. This MacBook I've had since like 2000 and, no 2011, it's a 2011 Mac. It's the longest I've actively used one computer for. This laptop was basically what I was running when I did my first Eastwood videos. It's been very useful for the past couple years. All right, so I finally took a shower and I edited two videos and it is 4.30. Most of my day is pretty much shot, but I'm gonna try to do one more video and then eat a good meal out somewhere. I'm done. I have awesome news. I finished all my video editing. So I can now hang out, relax, eat a good meal. By the way, I haven't touched a guitar today and I probably won't until tomorrow afternoon which is fine by me, because I'll be playing guitar all weekend.
Well, we made it to beautiful St. Michael, North Dakota. The weather's absolutely gorgeous. It's probably gonna get cold tonight, but thankfully we're playing inside. There. Mr. Ronquillo. That's me. All right, so I'm on the bus and I'm having my lunch. I usually bring my food on these bus trips. Number one, I have a gluten and lactose sensitivity. Number two, I don't like eating casino food. I just don't like eating at casino buffets. You don't want to get sick on the road, trust me. I bring my own food, which today I'm having some chicken stir fry and rice that I made at home before we left. I'm Filipino, so I have to have rice basically every day. I'm gonna eat this, and then uh, we'll probably be ready for sound check in a little bit. You wanna get some of this? So people always wonder why I like playing casino so much. Well, I'm gonna show you. hotel room is like right next to the venue. Go straight from the room right to the stage and as soon as we're done, go straight to the room and go take a shower. Take a shower, eat some dinner, and then uh, get ready for showtime. All right, I'm headed down to the stage right now. I'll see you guys after the show. Nectar of life. <laughs> Have a bowl of this.
I just got finished playing a show here in North Dakota, St. Michael, North Dakota. It's nice to be outside. It's nice and cool. You can go party now. Psych. I'm just gonna take a shower, eat some food, probably go to sleep. Cover your face again. Minnesota, just outside of Minneapolis. It's windy and a little rainy, but we're here. I'm walking over to the hotel, which is right next to the, the venue. Here's the venue, here's the hotel. Uh, yeah. Oh, look, old school keys. I don't see those often. Probably gonna have some lunch, do sound check, and then uh, bum around for a couple hours until showtime. There's not much to do. It's kind of a shitty day out and I don't know where I am. Can I join you guys? No, we have all these seats. You cannot sit with us. You have to sit there. Showtime, just watching TV on the bus, hanging out, getting ready for this late show, I'm ready to play. Let's do this. Meats and cheeses and chips and chips and fruits. And keyboards. And I'm gonna act like Bill Wyman all night. And there was his arm, a hook, <laughs> on the side of the car. <laughs> this guy's part Filipino. <laughs> Don't we look the same? Marriage proposal. So we be my girl. Second show is done. About to get my bag 
out of this hotel room and get back on the bus. A 15 hour ride home. Right, so we're back on the bus. Three of our guys are staying. Which means we have three junk bunks and, <laughs> and all the space in the world to spread out and do activities. So this is what we eat after show. Meat lovers, baby. I got this gluten-free, dairy-free pizza because I'm a little bit. bus is not generating power. Um, the bus is working, we just don't have air conditioning or TV, microwave, so we can still make it home. We're only three hours away. I don't know why we just took, we should just get on the road and get going. So we are stopped at a Kroger, Carbondale, Illinois. Power is only half working. We got all the windows open since there's no air conditioning. So I'm laying in my bunk with the curtain open just to get a little bit of breeze. Three hours to go. We're getting into Nashville. Bus drivers wanted to get on the 24 when we should have gotten on Briley. It's almost 6 p.m. Should be getting home probably by 6.37. Alright guys, if you like this video, click that thumbs up down below and share it with your friends. If you'd like to see more gear demos, lesson videos, and music related vlogs, click subscribe. Thanks for watching.